Hi guys, it's Miang and welcome back to my channel. So yes guys, as I promised from my last video, I will be uploading recalls and mass to know for immunology and serology. So eto na guys, okay, I will be sharing 10 recalls and mass to know for immunology and serology. So yes guys, okay, may upload na po ako nice to know for ISMBB. If you haven't seen that, Please see description for the link and also don't forget to watch my last video which is all about hematology. So yes guys, I hope that this video will help you in taking your board examination. So without further ado guys, let's get started. Number 1, Cook who killed several people by transmitting a typhoid fever and that is Mary Mallon. So, now guys, I am going to show you a table of the historical points, okay? These are the Nobel Prize winners in immunology. So, this is the table, guys, of the historical points, the Nobel Prize winners in immunology. So, as you can see, guys, in order na po yung year nila, yung discoverer, and their description. Mind you guys, sa lahat ng subject sa board examination, dito sa Immunocero ang pinakamaraming tanong when it comes to historical points. So, I advise you guys to know these Nobel Prize winners in immunology. Next guys, who discovers gel technology? And that is Yves Lapierre. So guys, you can see this sa page 274 of Harmoning Book, okay? In 1985, Dr. Yves Lapierre of Lyon, France, developed the gel test. So, I know, okay, na blood banking to, but since na pag usapan na rin natin ang mga discoverers, in-include ko na siya dito, guys. So, next, guys, it is an antigen determinant, and that is EP2. So, yes, guys, now I am going to share yung mga antibody variation. So, as you can see, guys, we have isotype, allotype, and idiotype for antibody variation. So, isotype, guys, it refers to the heavy chain that determines the immunoglobulin class. Allotype, it refers to the variations in the constant regions of heavy and light chains. Idiotype, it refers to the variations in the variable regions of heavy and light chains. So guys, this antibody variation is under the structure of immunoglobulins. So if you want me to make a video for that, please comment down below, yes, and I will try to make a video for that one. So next guys, Cypher 21 is a marker for the lung cancer. So, I am going to show you guys a table for tumor markers. So, this is a table guys for the tumor markers. So, as you can see, okay, there are markers for a certain cancer. Next guys, the macrophage found in the liver is the Kapfer cell. So, this is the nomenclature of tissue macrophages guys. We have liver for Kapfer cells, lungs, is the dust cells or alveolar macrophage. Brain or nervous tissue is the microglial cells. Connective tissues is histiocytes. Spleen is splenic macrophage or littoral cells. Lymph nodes is littoral cells. Placenta, Hofbauer cell. Bone, osteoclast. Kidneys, mesangial cells. Skin, mucosa is Langerhans cells. Next guys, acetiter is traditionally reported in what unit? And that is the TAD unit. Acetiter guys is an anti streptolysin O, a blood test that checks for a strep infection. Next guys, which of the following body fluids does not contain hepatitis B virus? So we have choices guys. Number one, we have the saliva. Next, sputum semen, and vaginal secretions. So, among the choices, guys, it is the sputum that does not contain hepatitis B virus, unless bloody. Next, guys, rapid HIV diagnostic algorithm, RIVDA, is the new HIV confirmatory in the Philippines. Next, guys, major cause of the post-transfusion hepatitis is the hepatitis C virus. So, among the viral hepatitis, hepatitis C virus is the major cause of the post-transfusion hepatitis. And the last recalls for this video, guys, the other name for the HCV RNA is the viral load. So, that's it, guys, for today's video. Thank you so much for watching and thank you for giving your time to this lecture video. So, yes, guys, if you're new here and haven't yet subscribed, 
do subscribe and give this video a thumbs like and you can also share this to your friends so yes guys if you want to enter for the giveaway see description for instructions my next video guys will be for blood banking so please be updated and to be updated okay click the notification bell and also follow me on my social accounts especially Twitter. so yes guys thank you for watching see you in my next one bye